This arithmetic reasoning practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, in his backyard, Julio has a small rectangular garden plot that has a 36-foot perimeter. The width of the garden is exactly one half of its length. What is the area of his garden in square feet? So for a problem like this, I always like to make a quick sketch. And in this case, we're talking about a rectangle. Uh, and in this case, we have to know how to find the perimeter as well as the area of a rectangle. Again, those are formulas you do have to commit to memory at some point. How do you find the area of a rectangle? It's simply length times width. Now, we'll talk about finding the perimeter of this rectangle in just a minute. That said, you should know some general properties of rectangles that you learned in elementary school. Notably that this length is equal to this length and this width is equal to this width. We know that we can represent the length in a rectangle with the letter variable L, but according to this problem, instead of putting W for width, let's talk about it this way. It says right here, the width of the garden is exactly half of its length. So in other words, its width in this case is gonna be one half L. Now, how do you find the perimeter of any regular polygon, including rectangles? You simply add up all of its sides. So to find the perimeter of this rectangle here, I'm gonna add up all of its sides. So it's gonna be one half L plus L plus one half L plus L. I, what's more, we know that a perimeter, our P of this garden is 36 feet. So this becomes 36 equals all right, let's do this part mentally. L and L is gonna be uh, two L. One half L and one half L is just one L. So two L plus one L is gonna be three L. Now we can solve for L by dividing both sides by three. This crosses out, this says L equals, what is 36 divided by three? Three divided by three is one, six divided by three is two. So we know the length of this garden is 12 feet. We can go ahead and plug that into the area formula now. What is its width? Well, right here is the width of this rectangular garden. We know width in this case is equal to one half its length. And uh, we know its length is now 12. So this is one half times 12. One half of 12 is six, All right, So this becomes 12 times six. And if you can't do that mentally, you can always do it off to the side, 12 times six. 2 times 6 is 12, carry a 1. 6 times 1 is 6, plus 1 is 7. So in other words, the area of his rectangular garden is going to be D, 72 square feet.